from takeoff to 10,000 feet. No disturbance. The cabin crew should not call the pilot or in any way at all distract them because that is a very important and uh, critical phase of flight. All right, guys. How are we all doing today? And I know say once camera show, waiting the follow and I wait to in. Update straight up. All right. Together with my lovely group members, we are welcome on As you can see, now everybody wake up close and come this move right now and try to play. They download all our bags and put it by. Today, road clear. So today, the update where we carry come today and waiting about the signs then we there for inside the aeroplane. Both the lights, both the sound. Some of them are sit down for inside the aeroplane. You will just be hearing all those boom, boom. Bros, give me one sound for there. Just give me one sound. No. Uh -huh. You just like this one. Okay, very good. Just leave it like that. Good. Now, when I see this uh, rainbow light, we there for here. How many colors there here? It's uh, five. Five colors. Do you all know that each one signifies something? This is not for fancy. These lights you are seeing here, each and every one of them signifies something. Once you see any of them blink, something is happening. Somebody is calling somebody. Either passenger is calling cabin crew, or cabin crew is calling pilot, or pilot is calling cabin crew, or there is emergency, or uh, maybe the pilot said that the cockpit, that nobody should disturb them, like sterile cockpit. All of them now in the air, or maybe a person don't lock himself for inside lavatory. Like so many of us, we enter the lavatory. We know the way to enter, but we don't know the way to come out of the lavatory. We will go discuss all of them today. So do wait in, stay tuned. May we talk about all these lights and the sound and where they follow them, one after the other. Take it off. Let's take it one after the other. We will start from this side. So from here, give me the sterile lights. So we see, we see how it goes. Good. Did you hear the sound? Boom. And this yellow light or amber light comes on. This sterile light now is in the cockpit. What it means, whenever you are sitting in the cabin and you see this light on, what it means is that the pilot doesn't want any disturbance at all. So it's you will you will always be seeing this light on this yellow light on on this aircraft too, so many other aircrafts different aircraft different designs and different uh, configuration depending on the manufacturer design their own but for this Embraer E195 E2 this is the way it for it functions so the sterile light you will always see it on on takeoff once they close the door the cabin has been secured by the cabin crew before takeoff. They will tell the pilot that the cabin is secured for takeoff. The pilot will put on the sterile light. This light will come on. So this light will go off based on the company uh, operating procedure. Like our own company is 10,000 feet. From 10,000 feet, from takeoff to 10,000 feet. No disturbance. The cabin crew should not call the pilot or in any way at all distract them because that is a very important and uh, critical phase of flight so the lights will come on again towards approach to land when the cabin crew must have alerted the pilot that the cabin is safe and secured for landing all right so for all of una we be say when i go the run up and down even when when i don't they look see say aircraft on the reach ground when I see the run up and down, I know go fasten on a seat belt and all that. This light will never come on when you are doing all those kind of activities. You must be seated, passing your seat belt. With that, every part of the cabin is well secured. Then the cabin crew will come to the cabin crew station and call the pilot and say the cabin is secured for landing. The earlier they do that, the better for us. It can happen before 10,000 feet, it can happen below 10,000 feet for at least. Once the cabin is secured, that is when they will call the, co the cockpit and tell them that the cabin is secure for landing. The pilot will put on the lights again and you will see these lights come on towards landing. All right. So when you hear that sound, you peep from your seats. If you are using the embryo, look. From here, you can know who is calling who and what each light signifies. All right. That is for the sterile light. After the sterile light is the green light. Call the pilot, call the crew. Good. So you see this? 
you see as it's flashing so you might be in the cabin sitting and you hear that sign boom boom if you remember the stereo light when it came on it was just one one sound ding that you heard but on this one now it sounded twice boom boom and this light is flashing so wherever the cabin crew is if they are serving in the cabin and they just hear the sound once they hear that sound they will turn immediately they turn they look here once they see this light green light flashing they do what they already know that is the what is the pilot that is calling they will immediately rush and go to the flight attendance panel i will show you guys the flight attendance panel after this they'll go to the flight attendance panel and pick the intercom and do what and uh, answer the call with the pilot so the pilot will be in the cockpit and discuss or talk with the communicate with the with the cabin crew on their cabin crew station once they finish the um the communication the cabin crew once he stows back the interphone puts it back in the jack the what the light will go off